Things are not all peaceful and pastoral on the farm. There seems to be a ruckus of some sort. You're right. They're all pretty mad. Water works really hard on the farm, and we figure we shouldn't have to carry a bunch of sediment and phosphorus along when we head down the old watershed. Nothing grows without water. Crops like corn and wheat need water. Hogs and cows and even chickens need water. It's an important job. Seventy percent of the Makatawa watershed is agricultural land. Farmers use buffer strips, which are grass strips 50 foot wide or wider, to keep their farming activities further away from the streams. Uh, farming activities include application of fertilizer and pesticides. The water, as it would pass from that area, it would go through the grass buffer strip and be filtered out before it enters the streams. Water on the farm might come from irrigation. That's where the farmer pumps water onto the crops. Or it might be from rain. Farmers are always hoping for rain. Not so fast. Too much rain passing over a farm creates problems for the watershed. Yeah, stormwater can be kind of pushy and carry all sorts of stuff into the watershed. Actually, farmers are mandated by the state to manage their manure to prevent that from happening. Farmers manage their manure by storing it properly and by applying it at the proper time in the proper amount so that the crop can use it, making it sustainable. Ugh. I think we all need to get the word out about keeping stuff out of our watershed. Spread the word about how sediment and fertilizers affect the watershed and what farmers can do to help. <laughs>